Growing up, I grew up on a farm, and I think just being around nature my whole life, I'm very passionate about the environment, and I'm very passionate about environmental science. My first impression of the department was that these people are very passionate about what they do. They've done work before, you know, in the, in the field. I uh, did a chemical toxicology lab, the Chem and Tox lab, and um, the stuff that we did was actual practical stuff. We did uh, soil cores, and I've done my internship, and basically I've done the exact same thing to collect data. For, we're doing a, a study on forest fires and microorganisms in their communities, and the things that we've done in our labs are the actual practical things that we will be doing in our job, and I think that's amazing. So I was actually told by one of my professors that they needed uh, volunteers at Sybil Nature Center. They needed an outdoor field guide to help with their education. They're usually third and fifth graders and we basically teach them about ecosystems. It's very hands-on because a lot of these children have never really been in nature. I want to teach these kids and I want them to be passionate about it. At the same time, I try to be as fun as possible just to keep their attention, you know. We have great internships and, th and they'll guide you to help you you know, figure out what you want to do and where you want to go. Like all my volunteer work, I would have never found without the department. The volunteer work itself has been so fulfilling. You know, it's, it feels wonderful to know that I've helped these people or I've taught some children about ecosystems or the environment. I'm the first person to graduate high school for my family. I'm the first person to go to college. And it's a wonderful staff, wonderful faculty. Everybody, the students, everybody I've ever met at UTSA have been just completely amazing.